and so far no chances to speak of. Nielsen with the free kick here. One or two of the big men from the back have gone forward for Norway. We'll see if he can pick out one of them. Bratsev got there, and Bratsev got it. A defender who's an all-purpose footballer, this boy, has done it for his country once more. It's this evidence of the power of Rune Bratzet in both penalty boxes that's persuaded Werder Bremen, one of the top sides in German football, to make him just about their most valued asset. And he's done it for his country here. Nielsen. Nice little touch inside was by Bowen in one of the new faces. Norway full of running and full of confidence after that good start. Poor defending again from the Cameroons, and that's the result, and it's Bernan, who's made it two. Cameroon at sixes and sevens, to say the least here. Nobody picking up a loose ball on the edge of the box, and poor William Andeem, in his first big game for his country, has already had to pick it out twice. Lovely finish from Lars Boinen. They really are stretching them at the back all the time. It was a good clearing header from Tortau on that occasion. But plenty of place again. Alson Ford and brilliantly finished by Tori Andre Dolom. It's a long time since these Norwegian fans have seen their team exploiting poor defending in this manner it was poor defending but how they've been made to pay in the first half here here it is once more all the time in the world on the edge of the box clinical downward header Norway in total control this boy who's been in and out of things for Norway Cameroon respond in the second half. No sign of it so far. Here's one of the subs at halftime. For your top with all the time in the world, no offside. And it's getting worse and worse for Cameroon. That's not a bad way to announce your entry. Jan Arda Fjortoft, regular goal scorer for Norway down the past couple of years, but left out tonight as one or two new boys were tried out up front, brought on and immediately scores once more. 4 nothing Norway. Defence all over the place again. Same fellow, Fjorto. Good save this time from Andeem. About the first thing he's done right in the game. Couldn't kick that out. Defenders flying around trying to protect the goal. It's either a goal or a handball. Referee's going to consult the linesman. And we'll see what they decide between them. Look like a handball on the line from Fjortov's drive with everybody trying to play goalkeeper for Cameroon. And it looks as though the referee will give a penalty rather than a goal for a deliberate handball on the line. Here it comes again. There's the hand. And indeed, from another angle, we'll probably see it more clearly. Nice save from Andeem on this one occasion, at least so far. But there was the handball may even have crossed the line. No matter what should be a straightforward chance for Per Agil Alsen of Brand Bergen. Well, you never know in football, do you? You never know. All the experience in the world, the backbone of the midfield, and he does this with a penalty when his team is leading 4-0. It remains 4-0. Norway affording the luxury of a very poor penalty. Brat Seth getting forward. Now Cameroon in the World Cup delighted us with their athletic attacking and surprised us by their ability to mix it up when things got rough. And I wonder if we're about to see the same thing. One or two loose tackles beginning to fly in, but they can't stop shoring up the holes. And it's another one in what is a procession. Fjortov once more. Two chances, two goals since half-time, plus a penalty created and then missed. This was his second.
keeper going one way, ball went the other. And every Cameroon defender had stopped and stared and watched it go in. Piotr was first yet again. Toto has had a long losing battle tonight. Could be another one here, probably will be, and it is. They're all getting on the act. Joran Solot with this one. Through the legs of one defender it went. Nobody was covering. And when eventually Onana looked like he might get a touch on the line, Solov, to give him credit, was much quicker and more determined. And Norway goes six here. Cameroon still looking for a little respectability. Getting men forward here. Belly Belly coming in. Nicely finished by one of the new boys. Torsford couldn't keep it out on his near post. And a little chink of light for Cameroon, but they're not going to win this friendly. Here's the goal. Vele, Vele getting in between two men, Thorsford unable to keep it in. And a boy who's already been scoring goals in the national team, he scored against Sierra Leone, ends things with a little glimmer of hope. Norway's fans have been lamenting recent form, and it was very easy tonight against a makeshift side. Tougher test to come. Next, they play Cyprus in the European qualifying group three.